السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته. Uh, good afternoon everyone. This is Dr. Muhammad Jum'a, the Math Chair of Finance and Accounting at City University College of Ajman. My paper title is The Impact of Digital Services in the Banking Sector and Human Resources Roles in the Case of the Fourth Industrial Revolution. Uh, I will be concise and inshallah will not take too much time and will be limited to the uh, instructions that has been given to us that I need to be in 10 minutes or maximum inshallah 15 minutes maximum. So the uh, the paper uh, actually uh, based in uh, a report has, uh, that has been published by the Central Bank of UAE on the 23rd of February 2020 indicating that the number of banks employees decreased by 2.71% uh, uh, in 2019. Uh, and 92 job, 92 jobs uh, opportunities have been evaluated, noting that the total banks employees was 35,637 employees in 19. Uh, furthermore, the UAE central banks pointed out that he's studying the impact of this employee's contraction in the economics, clients, and regulation. So the purpose of this paper, of this study, is to provide a better understanding of how the application of digital services in the banking sector might influence the level of human resources, HR's participation in the case of the fourth industrial revolution. Further, it aims at exploring the relationship between factors influencing the application of digital services and the human resources role in the uh, banking sector. So uh, the, uh, uh, the, the questions that has been uh, addressed in the paper are two questions. What are the internal factors that influence the changing role between the human resources and digital technology in the banking world today? And also what are the external factors that are affecting the changing role between uh, human resources and digital technology in the banking world today. Uh, the methodology of the study is a mixed research, qualitative and quantitative. Uh, the study co was conducted by using interview methods and field notes. And uh, the main thing is to compare the role of HR with digital technology in 15 of the 11 best banks in Ajman, UAE. And I will show you those 15 banks later on that has been chosen in uh, uh, Ajman uh, uh, as a branches of those 11 banks. And uh, we uh, uh, classify the uh, internal factor of the banks, which is uh, cost efficiency, demand for services availability, without breakdown time, easy access to the data, without obstacles, unlimited services coverage, and technological, uh, technological development and the ease of uh, reports preparation. There are five aspects of the internal factor that can uh, uh, affect the role of be, between the HR and digital technology. Uh, what about uh, 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 the external factors uh, are the regulation of the central banks uh, regarding the use of banking technology and digital issuance, the emergence of fine tech te uh, financial technology, uh, companies, market demand related to e-commerce transaction and competition in the banking industry to provide the best uh, customer services. Those are the uh, 15. See so here we can go to the, uh, we have uh, 470, 470 uh, bank branches uh, along the OE in 19. And uh, here we choose Ajman. If you see this is, we have 15 banks in Ajman. So we have 15 branches in Ajman. So we choose two from Abu Dhabi Islamic banks, well, one from Abu Dhabi uh, commercial banks, uh, one Emirates MBD, uh, two Fez Gulf Bank, two Dubai Islamic banks, and one Rak Bank, and one Mashrif Bank, and uh, five uh, commercial, uh, commercial bank of Dubai. Uh, in order to collect the data about the data collection, uh, we, I prepared uh, a questionnaire, and I did a pilot test with 15 samples, uh, has been distributed to the expert in the banking industry 
uh, I received some modification, uh, some uh, revise uh, of the questionnaire. I did, I modified the questionnaire according to the suggestions submitted by the respondents and experts in this field. And uh, 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 meanwhile, I conduct Chromebox Alpha just to test the uh, the reliability of the questionnaire since we have quantitative uh, variables and see all the variables has been recorded 0.8 and that means uh, the test is reliable. So this is here, the, uh, see all of them is 0.8 uh, for all those variables from cost efficiency to the competition in the banking industry. We have external and internal factors and I did this uh, uh, and the uh, this is reliable. Also here, the uh, uh, research variables, we have two uh, variables here, that the dependent variables is the HR role and the independent variable, which is the digital technology. The, well, I have two hypothesis testing. The first hypothesis is the, I just uh, make that there is a correlation between the controlling internal factors of digitization in the banking structure and the human resources roles in the case of fourth industry and, uh, revolution. And the, uh, the second hypothesis is there is a correlation between the controlling external factor of digitization in the banking sector and the human resource role in the case of the fourth industrial revolution. Uh, I, uh, according to the literature, uh, literature review that I just mentioned uh, here, I just, uh, in a nutshell, I will just uh, uh, brief you about that. Most of the literature review indicated that there is a relationship between the digitization and the number of employees or the role of HR in the banking sector. Here is Gupta and 17 in India. He mentioned that the uh, digitization changed or revolutionized uh, the uh, role of HR in the banking sector, and uh, it has been uh, affecting the way that the service has been offered to the public. And also here, the uh, uh, Noor in 19 in his in her blog in LinkedIn. Uh, uh, mentioned that the traditional banks are struggling to cope with the competition and, to, and strive uh, for survival. And uh, her blog uh, title is You Live or Die. And she said that the, the banks should be changed, otherwise should, will, uh, it will be died. Uh, and she mentioned that some banks is uh, shifted uh, totally to be online uh, banking like in, 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 uh, in UK, uh, she mentioned uh, in the UK, like uh, 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 some banks here, like st st uh, Sterling Banks and Monzo in uh, UK, uh, and also the, she men mentioned in the uh, in the US, uh, Chimmy and Movin, well, which are all, all of them transferred to be uh, online. So uh, she mentioned that the bank should be shifted to uh, to be online uh, to 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 uh, provide service online otherwise it, uh, they will die uh, also uh, deloitte in 2020 and their website uh, in a blog uh, in a blog uh, called strong today weaker tomorrow that they uh, also indicate that the the bank uh, will not longer measure by the uh, size of assets but the uh, it will be measured by the ce measured by their asset, but they, they, they will measure by the size of data and how it can be used effectively. So this is very important uh, to know that the, the bank now should uh, should be uh, used the, the data. And uh, now we have a data and the banks, they have a huge data, but this data is unstructured. They cannot use it effectively. Uh, uh, for the UAE, uh, for the, uh, this can be considered as a main factor that affecting the banks. Digitization can be a main uh, factor that affecting the banks. So the uh, United Arab Emirates must be considered uh, this. And also uh, in the other side, they will should give in the customer reaction, uh, 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 customer reaction uh, uh, and loyalty uh, plays a very important role here to success of the services. So uh, in this regard, they should yeah, um, study the both factors, the digitization and the reaction of the customers uh, in a way that uh, the banks and managers in United Arab Emirates are in urgent need to understand the customer point of view in this regard in order to, to, to develop the digitization and obtain customer acceptance and satisfaction. 
Then the, uh, we can go to the analysis part and interpretation. Here we'll, do, we'll go to the uh, uh, interview part, what I have found, and also for the uh, analysis part using the regression analysis. Uh, and in a nutshell, in, uh, I would can see that uh, most of the respondents was male with the 68.9 uh, uh, and 31% was female. Uh, for the age group, uh, most uh, like uh, we can say that like 70% uh, of the respondents were between 18 to 40 years old. Uh, and also about the internal factor, I, we can say that the cost efficiency and the technological development was the uh, main internal factor that influenced the changing role between human resource and technology. Uh, for the uh, external factors, we can say that the regulation of the central bank, so it's uh, like uh, um, uh, 17, uh, we have 45, by the way, the sample size, 17 of them, 37%, say that the re regulation of the central banks uh, is the main uh, external factor that uh, 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 changing the role between human resource and digitization. Uh, next is, is, is the emergence of financial technology companies. Uh, here we can make that uh, uh, the use of online banking by the clients. We can see that, and this is some, a big concern for the bank, uh, see the 21% of banking clients using the online service occasionally. And this is yani, a big concern of the banking that 21%, this is not like a low percentage that those are using occasionally the online banking services. Uh, about the regression analysis, also I did the regression analysis for the internal and external factors. So first, the, uh, for the internal factors, this is the regression analysis, this is the multiple R. We have 98 percentage that the internal factors affecting the changing role of the HR. Uh, R square is 97, adjusted R square, uh, you see is 94 percent. Uh, in that case, that this is going to be, uh, we can say this is significant the significant of the uh, of the, uh, the significant uh, of influencing the internal factor to the uh, role of HR. Uh, this is 94 percent. That means this uh, this model is significant. Uh, and also we can run the ANOVA, and you can see the ANOVA that the significance of the test is uh, significant. Here is, uh, the p-value is 0 0.0025, and if test is uh, to 31, uh, and this uh, indicates that the uh, internal factors has a statistically uh, uh, significant, the, uh, that the, uh, the internal factor is uh, affecting the changing role between the HR and digitization, so the H1 is accepted or we fail to reject the H1, uh, and there's a correlation between the controlling internal factor and the banking industry and the role of human uh, resources since the uh, F-test is significant. Why, uh, and this is the intercept. You can see here the intercept, we have a, a negative. So we have negative coefficient of uh, ease of access, and also we have negative unlimited set, while the other factors are positive, like cost efficiency, positive, and the uh, easy of report positive and communicative one is positive that this is, uh, they are uh, affecting the change role in a positive way, while the ease of access and unlimited service affecting the role in negative way. Uh, and this is the, 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 the model. For the uh, external factor, we see the external factor with the correlation is uh, 0.76. And the R square of just 0.58, and see the the adjusted R square just 31 percent of the uh, that of the external factor factor are affecting the uh, the uh, the uh, the changing role between the HR and uh, and digitization. So that means uh, and this can give you that uh, the level of significance here is low comparing with the internal factor. Uh, and also if we run the ANOVA. You can see this is see the p-value insignificant. So uh, we can say that that the uh, the uh, the relationship or the correlation between the external factor and the banking uh, uh, digitization uh, in the banking industry is insignificant since the p-value uh, is uh, is high. And this is you can see this is we can reject the H2 and we can say that the uh, because this is statistically insignificant. And uh, see here, that we have uh, that for the coefficient, we have the market demand, this is negative, we have negative uh, influence, and uh, for also for the regulation of central bank is negative, while the other factors are uh, positive influence as, as the external factor. 
we, if we examine the data uh, here, we can uh, say that yes, we uh, according to the data or the analysis that we have, uh, the, we can discover the dominance of the artificial intelligence revolution in the role of human resource uh, management in the banking sector to a large extent, especially in the operation department, like transfer, clearance, payment, retailing. Uh, uh, thus, this will increase the demand for qualified personnel from different disciplines who are able to make optimal use of information uh, technology. Uh, but the, the, uh, in a conclusion, but uh, yes, we agree that uh, the technology uh, has affecting the role of HR. But can we say that the artificial technology robots can be replace the human services uh, totally? The direct answer, no because those robots can support the services provided by human resources in the bank. There are many areas where the human mind needs to make decisions. The bank's business is mainly concerned with studying the customer needs. So in that case, the, sub, uh, the, the robots can support the entire operations by making difficult tasks easy by like what we are currently seeing on internet banking services that provide transfer payment of bills, clearance, insurance of checkbook and the other services. But uh, those uh, uh, artificial intelligence, those reports cannot deal with a customer a complaint or the customer uh, problems. Uh, and most of the customer don't prefer dealing with the robots or with the artificial intelligence when they have problems with the banking services. And this is based in the observation and interview, by the way. Uh, this is uh, in a nutshell uh, about the, uh, I hope that I'm not taking too much time. Thank you for listening. Uh, and uh, this is my email. Uh, if you have any questions or inquiry uh, for this regard. Thank you very much for listening. Uh, uh, and assalamu alaikum.